Hey, what's up? This is Spider Prime One back again with another Transformers video review. All right, I'm gonna try and blow through six six reviews right now. Um, first one being uh, Transformers Prime Wave Three Knockout. And let me just say, Knockout is one of my favorite Decepticons from uh, the Prime TV show, mostly because of his voice actor. Um, for those of you who don't know. And I can't think of his other roles. I only know two other roles that he's done. He was the janitor on Ned's Declassified School Survival Guide. Uh, that was on Nickelodeon for about two seasons. And he was also the dad from Fairly Odd Parents. Um, so, it's more... I love his character, but I it's also more funny just to try and find how many... Um, Dinkelberg jokes that you can throw into uh to a scene that he's that he's in. Um so yeah. That's one of the reasons why I like him. I also like him cuz just because of his character and he's actually the first Decepticon medic that I know of. Um cuz the Autobots have always had like Red Alert or Ratchet. Um uh, but this is the first time the Decepticons have actually had a medic. Um, cause they always refer to Knockout as the good doctor, or the doctor, or, um, our medic, or something to that effect. So, for all intents and purposes, Knockout is the medic. Um, and he has the proud, um, the, uh, I don't want to say opportunity, cause he already has it, but he, he's, he is the proud first, uh, to be a medic for the, the Decepticons. Um, so, and it's a really good toy. Um, this is another one of the ones that I find myself transforming to and fro, um, more often than not. Um, he rolls really nice. Um, his ports on the side that hold his electro staff aren't very aren't as obtrusive as I would as I thought they were going to be when I first got him. Um they're actually well hidden out of the way. Um so and it's a good vehicle mode. I just the same complaint everyone else has had. I wish there was more gold on him in the tires um and in robot mode and uh so no need to say things that have already been said. Um, so, let's transform him. First what we want to do is separate the back of the car from the front of the car. And we'll split the legs. I'm going to turn the uh, bumpers back. And you want to pull, separate the feet from the the calf of the leg. There's his feet. So there's the lower half done. Now here's where knockout can get kind of confusing. Especially going back into vehicle mode. Alright, you fold this part out. You fold open this tab piece here. I'll flip the hand out. Alright, you fold that open. You flip it around. And then you close it again. And then you close this over the arm. But we'll do that as soon as we flip the uh, flip the arm around. Okay. Now we close this. There we go. So that's how his arm works. Try it again while I'm looking at it. Not through my iPad. Okay, so we bring it down. Then we open up that tab. Or that... Uh, bendy part. We flip it around, fold the hand out, fold this piece back down, uh, fold the arm out, fold the uh, roof down, and then turn up the bicep. And there's his arm. And then what we want to do is we want to grab this red panel here and then flip forward the bumper so it looks like this. 
and then we're going to separate these and go up like that. And then we're going to come like this. We're going to bring it all the way down. And there's a tab and slot. We're going to plug that in. We're going to close his, for lack of a better term, belt. Um, oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Shoot. Hold on one second. There we go. Had to pop his head all the way out. And then there's grooves on the inside in here underneath the the headlight hood area. And they go over the lips that are on his uh the rest of his hood. And that keeps his chest steady. And there's Knockout. So yeah. Um, once again, like everyone else, the wheels need to be up just a little bit farther. And then he needs to have a lot of gold detail in here. Um... But the way he looks, he looks fine. Um, I've seen the ARMS Micron version, and I think it's kind of goofy that he has one of the plugins right in the middle of his chest. So it looks like he has like a, like a parasite on his chest or something. Um, I don't know. Um, the arms look really good, and they actually look show accurate, because the, in the cartoon he had the doors on the side of his arm. Um... I like his head. I wish his eyes... I don't know. Yeah, his his eyes were red. All the Decepticons' eyes are red. But I don't know. These look pink to me. Even off, even off camera, they look kind of pink. I don't know. Just something about them just doesn't look right. I almost wish they had given him, like, clear clear light piping, and then, like, painted red circles for his eyes. Maybe that would have been a little bit better. But I don't know. Something something about the all red head and then the red eyes, or pink eyes. I don't know. Just something about it doesn't, doesn't look right to me. But, minor complaint. And then, you can take his electro staff and plug it into either hand if it'll go in his hand <clears throat> there we go or if you don't want him to hold it but you want it you know still near him you can use the peg from from plugging it in on a car mode and then there's two uh, plug-ins back here. And now we can have it kind of over the shoulder. So, a little bit of option there for you. But uh, this is Transformers Prime Knockout. I'm Spider Prime 1. I say go get him. And I'll be back with another review pretty soon. But uh, until then, I'm signing out.